Hello boys and girls. Today we are going to hear the story the bunny yarl, the flies, and the warnuya, the bees. This is an Australian folk tale, so it's very similar to the other fables that we have read. Except this one comes from Australia. When I finish reading, I want you to consider what you think might be the central message of the story. Remember to think about what happens at the beginning, identify the characters and the setting, the middle, which is the problem of the story, the end, how the problem was solved, and then again, your central message. Let's get started. Bunny Yarl the flies and Warnua the bees. Once there were two groups of people, the Bunny Yarl and the Warnua. They were family and they lived in one camp. The Warnua worked very hard. They always gathered food, even when there was already enough. They, they did this so that they would have enough later. The bunny yarl did not think about the future. They wasted their time playing. They never thought about getting enough food for later. One of the warriua said, come out with us. We are going to gather honey from flowers. Soon the winter winds will blow the flowers away. Then there will be no more honey to gather. No said the bunny yarl, we have something to do here. And off they went, wasting their time. They knew that the Wuanara would share their honey with them. The Waranua went alone and left the bunny yarl to waste their time. The Waranua gathered the flowers and stored the honey and never more went back to live with the bunny yarls, for they were tired of doing all the work. As time went on, the Warnua were changed into little wild bees, and the lazy bunny yarls were changed into flies. All right, that is the end of the story. Think about what the central message may be. What lesson could you have learned from this story? And also think for a second, does this story remind you of another story? If you said the ant and the grasshopper, you are correct. We're going to spend some time in a few days comparing and contrasting the two stories. That's it for right now. Go back to your Google Slides and finish your writing assignment. See you later.